Hi everyone, here is another semi-annual sale haul for Bath & Body Works. I'm going to go over all the buy online, pick up and store orders that I did. So I'll put a screenshot, but I did one buy online, pick up and store order. I tried to get Buttercups and Berry Bellini, the Fresh Getaway Mini Perfume Spray, and the Pink Pineapple Sunrise in the Travel Size Spray. And all of them were cancelled, so um, that was unfortunate. And then that same day later on, I tried to place another buy online pickup and store order at a separate location. And I tried to purchase strawberry pound cake in the fine fragrance mist. And honestly, when I saw that, I had a feeling this whole entire order was going to get canceled. But I also included two Japanese cherry blossom body lotions in the older packaging, as well as a bubbly rosé travel size fine fragrance mist and Japanese cherry blossom in the travel size body lotion and once again this all got cancelled i mainly wanted to purchase the japanese cherry blossom for my mom that is her favorite scent and surprisingly at a third location it finally went through and i just got two japanese cherry blossom body lotions now when i went to go pick it up they handed me the bag and so i was really happy but i noticed that instead of it being the eight fluid ounce you know the regular size body lotions, they included the travel size ones. So it turns out that they had sold out, I guess right away. I guess it's the greatest fragrance of all time if people buy it up that quickly. So he thankfully was really nice, the guy who I got, and he ended up treating it as in like an even exchange. I'm not sure how he did it, but I wasn't questioning it. So let me pull out that bag. All right. So here is the bag for my buy online pick up and store order. I ended up getting the Japanese cherry blossom but in the newer packaging which I like. So my mom was a little bit worried that the lotions would go bad. I'm not sure how often she uses it but you know I kind of honestly like the older packaging but this one's okay. And the retail price for this is $14.50. So for this order, I spent a total of $7.43, and these were both technically 75% off. Now that I'm thinking about it, I probably should have asked to see if he would sell me the Japanese Cherry Blossom, the mini body lotions, because my mom did tell me that she would like a hand cream, but it completely escaped my mind. I was just happy that he was able to, you know, honor the purchase for me because he totally didn't have to. But yeah, this was order number one. Okay, so for my second order, it's a technically a price adjustment. Let me pull up the bag. Okay, so these were the price adjustments that I got. It was for the turtles, the candle wick holder, and the two silk holders. So initially, I was told that I needed to bring all the items back. That was at a different location than the one that I went to. Thankfully, I noticed that the sales associate, I've seen her a few times, even last in my annual sale. So I think she had more experience or she was more familiar with exchanges because she was able to do it without me actually having to like bring the items and I left them in my car. So I was thankful for that. I previously bought these items on June 15th, going for 50% off and the 14 days you know, to get a price adjustment, the last day I believe would have been June 29th. Let me go ahead and tell you the new prices. The candle holder was previously $17.47 and I ended up getting it for $8.73. The two soap holders, both, I got them previously at $12.47 going at 50% off and I ended up getting each of them for $6.23. I'm going to show you my price adjustment receipt. I ended up paying or I paid previously with like a Visa gift card that I got for a rebate. So um, they wanted to put the money back into the card but I just asked if I could do store credit and they gladly did. I ended up getting back a total of $23.35. So the turtles are back in the bag and I'm really glad that I ended up getting like a good amount of money back that I ended up using for another haul that I'm going to show in the same video. Um, but let me put this away because I also bought a few items at this store and that's in the bigger bag and I used up my 10 off 40. So let's go to that. 
So for this first in-store purchase, the subtotal of this first in-store shopping trip was $45.90. With tax, I spent a total of $50.60 and my total discount was $141.34. Everything was 75% off and I ended up using a $10 off 40 that I believe ends on July 1st. I think I have a bag just full of wallflowers, so I'll read to you what I got. The wallflowers with the coupon and the 75% off, they were either $1.54 or $1.53. You know how like each thing is off by a penny? So I'm just going to read off the scents. I'm not going to go into scent notes. The first is strawberry pound cake, which is my favorite scent. Then we have a pink pineapple sunrise. One in sunshine mimosa. The blends market peach and strawberry pound cake. Hop to it. Sweet Carrot Cake, now we have Pink Prosecco Frosting, what is this, Toasted Pineapple Marshmallow, another Strawberry Pound Cake, Cinnamon Spice Vanilla and Paris Cafe. Cinnamon Spice Vanilla and Paris Cafe again. Strawberry Pound Cake. Champagne Toast and Fresh Orange. And we have another one in Cinnamon Spice Vanilla and Paris Cafe. And the last one is Sunny Tropical Mango. Total, I believe there are 14 wallflowers. So these are all the wallflower scents that I picked up in the single refills. I spent a total of either $1.53 or $1.54. I had a 10 off 40 coupon, so the prices may be slightly different depending on how close to 40 you get. Now I'm going to go over to the rest of my item. I ended up getting a tester candle and black cherry seltzer, which I'm really surprised that they had this for up for sale, but this store is one of the ones that they are completely fine with selling tester candles. The retail price is $15.50. And then we had another candle. This was in the Sweet Carrot Cake Single Whip and it says hop to it. I believe this one was also $15.50. Yes, it was. I ended up getting just these two single wicks. Both of them retail for $15.50. So that makes each single wick with the coupon and 75% off $2.87. On to the next item. They have this wallflower duo pack in the scent warm apple pie. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I know for sure warm apple pie in the three wick was an online exclusive this year. So I had thought that this was maybe a return from an online order. I'm not too sure actually, but I have never had worn apple pie. I don't really like it too much in the um, like the single wicks or the three wicks, but I wanted to try it out. The scent notes for warm apple pie are baked apple, brown sugar, homemade crust. I want to say, but I don't see a price that this retailed for $14.50. So that made this dual pack with all the discounts $2.97. On to the next items or the last items that were just three wicks. First one is blueberry pie. I really liked this scent. I ended up, I think, giving away most of the ones I got the previous semi-annual sale, so I thought, why not? And this was one of the scents that were discounted online as well. Scent notes are juicy blueberries, flaky crust, sugar crystals with natural essential oils. It's a little scuffed up, but this is originally $24.50. With all the discounts, that made this candle $5.03. So that's really good for a three-wick candle. 
I don't think I'm ever going to purchase that at this price. I really like the crust or the flakiness of this candle. Okay, so this is candle number one. Um, I have a story for the last two candles. I'll just pull them out. So we have iced lemon pound cake. And we have black cherry seltzer. Now, I did a walkthrough. I'll try to link it in the cards, but... These were going for 75% off, and that was really weird because online, when I looked it up, it didn't show that this collection was 75% off. It was $10.95 at another store, and so I'm not sure what my store was doing, if they needed more inventory to sell out or to sell, but yeah, these were Ice Lemon Pound Cake and Black Cherry Seltzer were going for 75% off. Both of them retail for $26.50. The scent notes for Ice Lemon Pound Cake are sugar sugary glazed icing, pure lemon zest, and fluffy pound cake, whipped cream with natural essential oils. Black cherry seltzer scent notes are sweet black cherries, fizzy seltzer water, cane sugar with natural essential oils. And I noticed when she rang these up, they rang up for the full price, $26.50, but I want to show you my receipt because it seemed like she manually changed the price. Do you see how the blueberry pie, it just says 503, it says 2450, but then it says 503. This one has a little asterisk next to it. And I think that's because she ended up manually changing it. But yeah, these were 75% off. Um, so ice lemon pound cake came out to $5.02 and black cherry seltzer came out to $5.03. These are all the items that I got for the first in-store purchase plus my two um, Japanese cherry blossom pickups at the Buy Online Pickup and Store. And wow, yeah, I have a lot of bags. Um, I'll probably do a wrap-up video later on, but yeah, these are all the items I purchased for the first store. Now I'm going to get to my second haul. Okay, this is my... I, I'm losing count, but this is the haul that I did when I ended up going to pick up my Buy Online Pickup and Store order. Let me go to the receipt. For this store, I spent a subtotal of $28.77. With tax, that's a total of $31.72. My total discount was $109.23. Everything was 75% off, and I used the $10 off 40 coupon. Once again, you can use that coupon multiple times, and some cashiers are really nice, and they'll even offer to split up your transactions. I think I'll start off with the wallflowers. These came out to $1.38 or $1.39. First two wallflowers are just strawberry pound cake. I love that scent. Next was a black cherry seltzer wallflower refill. We have another strawberry pound cake. We have a refill in the scent cactus blossom. And then the last one was just the Market Peach and Strawberry Pound Cake. I got a total of six Wallflower refill plugs. And these were either, once again, $1.38 or $1.39. The next items are just single wicks that I purchased. I got the scent Raspberries and Whipped Vanilla in the Happy Easter packaging. And I got two of these candles. So cute. It smells so nice. Okay. These single wicks don't have the scent notes, but they cost originally $15.50. After all the discounts, I got both of these single wicks for $2.87. And the item that I really wanted to buy more of, but I haven't been so lucky besides soaps. And of course, you know, the unicorn finds of 75% off perfumes or room sprays. In my walkthrough, I showed that initially these had a 50% off sign sticker label next to them, but when the employee was ringing up different items just to double check the price, it came out to 75% off. I ended up getting just one of them, and that is in the Scent Island Margarita. The retail price of this is $8.50. With my discounts, this came out to $1.57. I was really happy I got at least one this sale. Next items are aromatherapy products. I don't really like aromatherapy, but the store had a lot of these, and it made me think of my friend who needs to be less stressed out. I don't know if you could guess what it is already, but I ended up getting the Stress Relief Body Wash and Foam Bath, as well as the Stress Relief Essential Oil Mist that they used to be called Pillow Mist, if I'm not mistaken. 
The retail price of this was $13.50. And then the body wash, wow, that's a big sticker, was $13.50 with my coupon and given that these were 75 percent off i got both of these for two dollars and fifty cents i think i'm gonna go ahead wrap this up and give it to her and for a total of like five dollars this is such a great gift once again the scent is stress relief and it is eucalyptus and spearmint the last item i had previously almost purchased this but it, i like i let it slip through my fingers and I found it again. So I thought, why not? Um, I'm on the fence about it now. It was a positively sweet candle. I think I misspoke earlier that I said I got everything for 75% off. This was actually $10.95. I'm not sure why I got it, but I really just wanted this scent ever since I first saw that it came out during the Valentine's Day collection. Oh, and the original price is $26.50. Scent notes are rich chocolate, gooey butterscotch, candy cherry with natural essential oils. I don't know, I just really like this scent for some reason. If anyone has burned this before, please let me know if it's good or not. I'm still on the fence, but I feel like I wanted this for a reason, right? So given that this was $10.95 and I used the 10 off of 40, this three wick came out to $8.13. These were all the items that I purchased in the other store. On to my last two bags. These are the final items that I purchased at a different location. I was really hoping to find soaps and room sprays. Unfortunately, no room sprays. So the soap total for this shopping trip was $20.19. With tax, that came out to a total of $23.35. The total discount for the shopping trip was $100.71. At the end, they owed me $1.24. Why do you ask that they owed me $1.24? It's because earlier that I said that I did a price adjustment, basically this haul was free. Well, I made money. Kind of weird logic, but anyways, let me show you the receipt. Okay, so if you look, they paid me out $1.24. So I think this is the same across all states or counties, but in California, if you have less than $10 in a gift card, the store has the ability to like pay you out or like buy the gift card off of you. And I really didn't want to carry a gift card with $1.24. So this haul is all thanks to the price adjustment that I got for the turtles. Even though they had soaps, um, they were $8.50. So I ended up not wanting to pay the additional dollar, I only want to buy soaps for $7.50. I know, weird logic, but I found this one that she rang up and it was going for 75% off and that is in the scent Strawberry Pound Cake. Notes are fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream made with essential oils. For this haul, my sister was nice enough to let me use her $10 off 30 and she got this from like the app glitch when it updated. The soap came out to $1.25 after all the discount, and that's like so awesome. That's like Dollar Tree prices now. I'll go ahead and go through my wallflowers. The associate was really nice and she wrapped up everything. At this store, I got a total of four wallflower refills in the scent Strawberry Pound Cake, Sweet Whiskey, Times Two, and Strawberry Daiquiri. This was my first time seeing Sweet Whiskey out, so I had to get two. Hopefully I like that scent. I know I do like it in the body care, but I've never had it in the foam fragrance. So here are my four wallflowers. Next are the candles that I got. I got the old packaging of Black Cherry Merlot. It was going for 75% off. And I believe the original price of this was $14.50. With the discount, that made the single wick $2.42. And then I ended up getting some newer three wicks. I got two single wicks in the scent pear creme brulee. These, since they're newer packaging, they cost $15.50. With the discount and everything, that made each single wick $2.59. Okay, so that makes this bag empty. Let me get to the item that I thought was the best purchase. I didn't even know I wanted it. And the associate was kind enough to bubble wrap this for me. Can you tell what they are? Probably not. I'll go ahead and unwrap them. Here they are. They are the clamshell soap holders. I'm not sure if the candle wick holder is going for 75% off, but these are so cute. 
I'm kind of biased, so I think that the turtle ones are cuter, but they had maybe five of these right at the front. I'm surprised that more people didn't purchase them. The retail price is $18.95 with the 75% off and my sister's $10 off 30. The clams came out to $3.17. Isn't that like wild? Retail price $18.95. The discount was like $14.21 and that made it $3.17. These were I think a score. I don't know if I'm going to use them as a soap holder but here is a quick demo of how it looks like with the soap. It looks so pretty. Can I even put like a single wick in here? I mean, I don't think I would burn it here, but <laughs> I mean, I don't think I would burn it like that. Um, I'd probably just display it. Actually, I changed my mind. Look, check it out. It fits, well, not perfectly, but it's slightly crooked but that's okay i don't think anyone's gonna like super notice it that much but yeah this is just how they look like with a soap and a single wig these are all the items that i purchased for my last shopping trip i got a total of three single wig candles two clam soap holders one soap and four wallflowers all right, I really need to clean my room, check out how it looks like, a little like sneak peek of how it looks. Ugh, it's so messy, but I don't like moving anything until I'm done with semi-annual sale. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video and have a great day. Okay, bye.